Shalom Israel. I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Raka, Kwadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone and Shalom to the hopeful elect 144,000. Shalom. Um, and I'll title this one uh, The Time of Jacob's Trouble. The Time of Jacob's Trouble. And uh, it's late. I'm, I'm just kind of get straight to the point on this one. Um, but I seen this in the headlines and the spirit hopped on me. Um, and this is I'm going to play this quick news clip. And this is off um, the 700 Club. Uh, and basically they're, you know, they're letting you know on shit is about to hit the fan. And uh, the oncoming uh, cyber attack that's about to happen in this place, America. And uh, this place is not prepared for war. And th these are the last days. These are the last days in this place uh, 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 of hanging out, you know, going to your friend's house and watching the football game or, uh, uh, you know, going to the, uh, you know, with family and friends to the beach, uh, everybody going over to uh, your auntie's house to, uh, uh, for the, bir you know, 38th birthday party, um, going grocery shopping, you know, uh, uh, cooking food in your home. You know, these, these are the last days going to work. The, the, the terror the judgment that the Lord is bringing on this place, America, Babylon, we have never seen. Never. We have never seen this before. The Lord about to cut the lights off and shut this place down completely for good. If you don't have the Lord in this end time, good night. This is unprepared for the most serious security threats it's faced since the United States is unprepared for the most serious security threats it's faced since World War II. That's the warning defense experts delivered to a Senate committee this week. CBS Del Hurd reports. The heads of the Commission on the National Defense Strategy told the Senate Armed Services Committee that the United States is nowhere near prepared for the dangerous multi-threat environment it's facing. The public has no idea how great the threats are. Commission Chairman Representative Jane Harmon and Vice Chair Ambassador Eric Edelman issued a dire warning to the committee Tuesday. The homeland, if there's a conflict, is not going to be a sanctuary anymore. And the first uh, attacks will likely be in the cyber cyber domain and they will be incredibly uh, disabling. The public is essentially clueless about the massive cyber attacks that could be launched any day by our adversaries, not just nation states, but rogue actors as well. The report warns a cyber war with China or Russia would be devastating. America's critical infrastructure would come under attack, possibly cutting off power, water, transportation, and financial systems. Hmm. You see? This is what's coming. Let me go here. This is what's coming. See, th th this was a grace period. This this was a grace period for ultimately you Israelites, man, a good you know, a good majority of our people, man. This was this was a grace period to uh, uh to seek the lord to get right with him you know to 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 put down your wickedness all that smoking weed and committing adultery and uh, uh gang banging and uh, um, uh pride and you know all of that man this was a time to get get right with the lord because the word has gone out the word has gone out Let me go here. Proverbs 1, Proverbs 1 and 24. Proverbs 1 and 24, and it reads, it says, because I have called. 
Hmm? Because I have called and ye refused. You ignored. How, how did the Lord, how did the Lord call? Because the Lord, he has set up the men out of his people, the prophets, the teachers, the men, his prophets out here sighing and crying and trying to uh, warn our people, man, on what the Lord is about to do. Warning you to get right. But a good majority of our people, they, they ignore this word. They too busy chasing the bag. It says, it says, and ye refused. It says, I have stretched out my hand and no man regarded. Just totally just ignore the Lord's word. And then you laugh at these uh, uh, prophecies that none of this is ever going to happen in, in our lifetime or none of this is going to happen. This is any day that this power finna go out, man. Twenty five, it says, but ye have set at not all my counsel and would none of my reproof. Twenty six, it says, I also will laugh at your calamity. I will mock when your fear cometh. The Lord is going to and he's going to put the fear in the people in the world, ultimately in this place, America, Babylon, because there's no fear of the Lord. The Lord about to cut this power, this electricity off. You're not going to be able to call no 911. You're not going to be able to call no sheriff. You know, it's going to be pitch black out here on these streets, man. And you're going to have murderers and serial killers. You're going to have gangs. You're going to have militia groups out here rioting and burning down places and infiltrating people's homes. Kidnappings. This is what's coming, man. So what the Lord say, he said, when you're, he said, he said, I also will laugh at your calamity. I will mock when your fear cometh. 27, it says, when your fear cometh as desolation and your destruction cometh as a whirlwind, when the stress and anguish cometh upon you, you know, when you can't. Do the same things that you've been accustomed to and you're, uh, 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 you know, you're facing danger 24 seven. Because this is how it's going to be out here on these streets. The sedition amongst men is coming. You, people going to be running up in these people's house. They got the food. They coming in groups and they're going to take what they want. The, the, these guns and, and, and weapons ain't going to save you in this end time. It's not going to save you, man. You're going to be in constant danger 24-7. And if you got a family, that's even more to it. You better hope the Lord is with you. Twenty-eight, I'll close out with this. Twenty-eight, it says, then, then shall they call upon me. But I will not answer. They shall seek me early, but they shall not find me. Shalom.